is a breaking news of an earthquake right now in the Hindu Kush area along the lines of Jammu and Kashmir. The earthquake measuring 6.1 in the Richter scale occurred just a few minutes back. The epicenter, as of now, initial reports suggest, is the Hindu Kush range of Jammu and Kashmir area. However, the tremors have been felt across North India right till the national capital of Delhi. The latest that we are getting in is that this was an earthquake which occurred about 20 minutes back in the Hindu Kush range of Jammu and Kashmir. The epicenter lies there. However, tremors have been felt across North India as well as much to the national capital and even parts of Uttar Pradesh is what we are getting to know at this point of time. However, the epicenter is uh, near the Hindu Kush range, uh, near uh, the borders of Afghanistan is initial reports which are suggesting to that nature. We are playing out for you the location of this earthquake, the epicenter of this earthquake measuring 6.1 on the Richter scale. However, tremors emanating from this earthquake has been felt across North India, all across Uttar Pradesh, the national capital, parts of Haryana and the valley and Jammu as well. My colleague Shuja ul Haq is with us. He's reporting on that story. Shuja, if you can get us exactly where this earthquake has taken place and has there been any damage as of now to life? Well, pretty. Uh uh, the information that we've been able to gather as of now is that the epicenter of uh, this uh, earthquake is somewhere in the Hindu Kush mountains. And uh, uh, the, on the Richter scale, it has been measured at around 6.1, uh, which in itself is a huge magnitude. Uh, of late, this is, this is one of the first ma uh, earthquakes in this region uh, that has been felt in this range. So clearly, there were very, very severe tremors that were felt all across the Mohan Kashmir particularly in valley and areas along line of control. Uh, mm -hmm. People people panicked, uh, a lot of uh, a lot of office goers actually left their buildings and uh, were seen queuing up outside right. uh, their buildings. So clearly a lot of panic after the uh, tremors were felt. Alright, we'll be getting those reactions, Suja. We'll be getting those reactions of uh, panic which of course took place right after this earthquake. Massive tremors being felt in the valley as Suja pointing out. Suja, has there been... Uh, do you, are you getting any word on loss of life and property right now? Well, as of now, there is no uh, information on the loss of life or property uh, as, is, as it is just happened to be the administration itself trying to uh, ga uh, trying to find out whether there has been any damage in the far-flung areas, particularly towards the line of control. But uh, the information that has been given to us just suggests as of now, no uh, mm -hmm. damages to any uh, any person or uh, any property. Uh, right, but, so uh, the epicenter, the epicenter is said to be the Hindu Kush Ranger. 6.1 on the Richter scale now. What we are being told as of now is that there are not many villages that side. Uh, there is not much habitation. Can you give us a clear picture on exactly the epicenter and the area surrounding this area? Yep, in the Hindu Kush range is what we are being told where the earthquake is taking place. Well, that's right, Preeti. It is, it is a mountainous region and it falls in the border areas only. That's the reason why there isn't much inhabitation. Uh, so that's uh, quite, uh, that's quite uh, one of the reasons why we have not been even able to get uh, the exact details from mm -hmm. the ground. Whatever small little villages there are, uh, it, it is very difficult to reach to them. But yes, uh, the administration is trying their level best to ascertain whether there was any damage to anyone in these villages also. But uh, it is a fact that this right. is a very, very mountainous region along the we're border. Gonna, we're going to try and build contact. We're going to try and build contact and get our viewers exactly what the damage has been there. So that if you can recount for us, we believe massive tremors were felt in the valley of JNK as well. If you can recount how long back 